My first team tonight kind of strikes me as that mismatched team of cops that get put together at the beginning of the movie that you don't think will work together well at first, but then after they spend the night on a stakeout together and they swap stories over Taco Bell food, they end up viciously shooting each other over who gets the last taco. Please welcome Matt Holm and Lindsay Jones. My second team tonight are enjoying their last night as free people here on the show. Tomorrow they are both heading to a local prison for voluntary surrender. He's doing it for tax evasion because he thought white people didn't have to pay taxes. And she's doing it because she's just a huge fan of Orange is the New Black and that's about it. Please welcome Meg Turney and Tyler Coe. I'm your host John Rice and you're welcome on the spot. Damn. So uh, the mics too. are going to pick yeah. this up, but apparently uh, there's like a hurricane happening over our studios. Yeah, right so in front of us, if like the show just stops, that because power went out and we didn't want to tape the rest of it. So um, funny we overloaded the system. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, also, this episode, before the power goes out, is brought to you by uh, Movement Watches and Trunk Clubs. Thank you very much, guys, for making us look pretty. Um, I have an interesting cast today. That yeah. was totally my original choice, and people didn't get sick and drop out or anything, and nope. I had to swap people around or anything like that, because that never happens on this damn show. <laughs> um, first team, Lindsay, Matt. Glad to know I was your first choice. Yeah, what you were actually, we you were actually one of the first choices I had to get you like down on the books very early. You're sure. a busy guy. You're, you're my first choice at your job, No, I'm too. not. You were like 15 <laughs> minutes late to the show. It'd be hard to replace. <laughs> I'm glad that we've already had some bonding, too. Like, Matt's been shoulder shrugging with me. That's I'm like, right. I appreciate that. What Thank the you. fuck is that? <laughs> it's kind of like, hey, what's up? All right, let's do yeah. this. Do you have to smile like that, Matt, while you do it? <laughs> I don't have to, but it helps. <laughs> um, it makes what, everyone more comfortable. What sort of team name did you guys come up for you guys? Well, we went back and forth a few times to try and come up with the best team name I'm ever. sure you did. And yeah. I think Matt finally settled on the best one, in Which my is? opinion. Yeah. Team Michael doesn't have to know. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> wow. His hands are so cold, but so warm at that's the same uh, time. <laughs> that took the awkward levels up a few he's notches. Not, he's not in the audience. Oh. 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 Yeah, no, oh. Michael's in the audience. <laughs> he? he can hear that okay, from he doesn't have to know. Hey, He's, he's not in the know. audience. He doesn't watch the damn He'll show, so you guys are fine. He'll never see this. <laughs> Your name starts with an M, too? Is this yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we made a joke during the rehearsal when the when the intro played, and Meg's like, ooh, look at the intro. And she's like, yeah, no one watches the show, so everything's new to everybody who comes on the show. Um, I did do that. Thanks for rehashing that. Yeah. Hey, it hurts. <laughs> it does. Okay. I'm sorry. Hurt people hurt people. Yeah. <laughs> what you guys got? Uh, so we wanted a team name that represented both of us. Yeah. Something people don't really know about Tyler is he's actually pretty clumsy. Yeah. Right. Falls all the time. So yeah. um, on set of free play, I would call him Slip. Slip. And I'm the girl from the team, so we're a team pink slip. Why not? <laughs> so that's the team names. Whoever runs HR at this company is loving the way <laughs> this is uh, sexual um, harassment. Yep. <laughs> uh, okay, slips. cool. So we got team names, and we're going to play some games now. And our first game is ABC's of Storytelling. ABC's of Storytelling is obviously the game where each team will be given a scenario and characters, and they're going to act out that scene like improv actors. What an idea. And they're going to do it over 60 seconds on the clock, and they're going to do that using the letters of the alphabet to uh, decide what the beginning line of their dialogue starts with. And they'll go down the alphabet, and they'll get points for every uh, letter they get through. They get negative points if they go to the wrong letter, and they can skip X and Z, but they get bonus points if they use them. Each team will be given a scenario, and they'll go back and forth, and, you know, most points wins. Um, so, team, Michael doesn't have to know. Uh, what is your scene? Lindsay asks Matt to help her set up a haunted house attraction with, you know, fake dead bodies. And Matt believes that Lindsay actually wants some real dead bodies. And this is from RT user Ray de los Manos. Monos. Manos. Ray de los Manos. Funny, because this, this has happened to us. Yeah. <laughs> this was his last week, On set actually. during a, a production. Um, so that's you guys' scene. What's your starting letter? H. Huh? H. Perfect practice, Lindsay. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, <laughs> let's start off with you, Lindsay, since you're apparently ready. 60 seconds on the stuff. clock, starting with H. Ready, set, go. Here, uh, help me hang these up. Uh, it's really not a good time for me. Just help me out here. What are you upset about? You know, killing time is what I'm doing here, <laughs> and you're just making it hard for me to, you know, do my thing. Well, let's reevaluate what we have here. We have five dead bodies here. I feel like we need three, three more to make it really gruesome. Yeah? 
Maybe, but wouldn't that be weird to have dead bodies no. just around here? No, no, we can live it up. If we want to go 16, 20, I mean, throw up 30. Who gives a shit? Oh, no, that would be that would be wrong. That's really wrong, Lindsay. You can't do that. Please. I, see the haunted house last year? They had like a whole body, full, like a whole room full of corpses. We're going to try and top that. Question for you. Mm -hmm. What are we talking about? Because it sounds like you're trying to involve me in some kind of nefarious plot. Realism. I'm trying to express realism through art here. <laughs> Uh, simply wrong. <laughs> simply wrong. No, I'm not going to go there. <laughs> You're fired. I like how Matt managed to turn the white level up really high during Absolutely that. Absolutely not. Simply I will not. wrong. I will not go there. <laughs> no. Matt's more classy than I am, too. Right. Where's my macchiato? <laughs> <laughs> um, like, you didn't get, like, upset at all. Just really low-key. Like, no, we will not have dead bodies here, Lindsay. <laughs> not, not in this house. <laughs> <laughs> Matt's, like, holding up their pinkies, too. Like, damn rig mortis. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> uh, bar, what kind of laugh is that <laughs> uh, okay cool so you guys got through a few letters there let's see if the other team can get uh, further let's see what Megan uh, Tyler's scenario is Meg is trying to run a cooking show and bake a cake with her assistant Tyler who every ingredient reminds Tyler of an ex-lover from <laughs> RT user TS Turtle Dove oh I got a big Rolodex to dip into <laughs> Rolodex? Yeah, of a little, you know, Rolodex of PNV. I know what Rolodexes are. I have one, but no one uses a Rolodex. You ever used a Rolodex? Damn Tyler? hipsters. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't even know how to spell that. I don't know how to spell it. This game is always, this is my bugaboo. This is a He was over one. there practicing the alphabet. <laughs> <laughs> He's just in the corner. Well, well, here's the thing is like. He did. He looked well, up like, and said, shut the fuck up. But yeah, I like. Shut the fuck up because I'm trying to figure it out. But like I always start at A. We're not going to start today, probably. No. Well, we'll oh, let's see. Let's did. see. Maybe it's randomizer. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Look at that. <laughs> this is called the easy edition of right. ABC's Storytelling. Here we Just go. for Tyler. Just for our little Texan boy, Tyler. Um, so, A. And Meg, since it's your show, your cooking show, we'll start off with you. Six eggs on the clock. Ready, set, go. All right, kiddo. We need uh, all the ingredients for the cake. You got everything? Uh, butter, butter's a great ingredient, but that really reminds me of the time I like to butter my baby okay, bread. Okay, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> calm down. <sighs> let's get back to cooking. Deal, deal, let's do that. Uh, but, you know, just going back to the butter for a second. You <laughs> like, just buttering those nipples. Okay, every time you open your mouth, I, I feel bad for hiring you, so just calm it down a little bit. Fine, 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 fine. Get it but, together. But the butter is really... <laughs> Get you know, it together, Tyler. <laughs> okay. Um, help me <laughs> to forget about all these ex-lovers. Everything reminds me of them. I feel like we're not remotely talking about the scenario that you need help with. Oh, you know, the, uh, jazzing up that cake with some <laughs> cream uh, just takes me back <laughs> to my ex-lover, Dominic. Keep your mind on the cake. <laughs> Off of Dominic, please. Man, I love cooking. <laughs> that was great. <laughs> oh, I think that's been the most honest you've ever been that on any production. Me. Just that amazing. helped me. I thought you were going to give me an ingredient to like... I you had to come up stuck on butter, you <laughs> sick fuck. <laughs> I can't believe it's not butter. Who hasn't buttered a nipple yet? <laughs> like he who has not That's buttered a nipple. I like the twist. That's the first you, I thought it was like female nipple. No, Dominic Dom is a part Dominic. of this. Dominic's yeah. buttery nipples. Mm. You know, we use the butter. You can use butter for a lot. We sell those. Dominic is still an ambiguous name, though, right? Dominique. Dominique, Dominique. but he's. It, like it Dominic. was a dude. I was thinking. Of, <laughs> yeah. Let me just clear it up. I was like greasing up. Though. I was greasing up Dominic. The Lord of the Rings, Dominic. Right. Yeah. That's why I'd grease up. Yeah, we, no. we had fun. Uh, that's fantastic. Uh, let's find out what points are. How'd you guys do? Uh, Ooh, hey, close game. Yeah. That's not bad. That's, hey, hey, we started on A, buddy. A, a little did. bit of a stretch. We started on A. <laughs> We're all pausing right now because God's of weather, Thor like is trying to get into stage five. Lord Zeno yeah. is not pleased. Or God's yeah. really upset about this show. <laughs> 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 or God just probably about the show. homosexual it's things I just talked yeah. about. I apologize. Uh, Lord, sorry. <laughs> It's the incoming. <laughs> what was that? Jesus doesn't like it when you talk about gay things. Or at least that's what I was taught. I was thinking genuinely. On cue. Yeah. On cue. Marriage is between a man and a woman. Stop. Stop it. No, no. And it stops. Not on this team, it's not. Okay. Um, oh. 
don't know what that means. I just, uh, God didn't want. We're both married. Yeah. Could you just okay. open, your, open your mind? Tyler, if uh, God didn't want those nipples buttered, he wouldn't have made them so hot. That is right. I'm just saying. He wouldn't have made the nipples you melt the butter so well. Yeah. You can't fight that logic. Uh, that on that long, note. greasy dick. <laughs> and that note. Let's add on the this. spot. <laughs> Shut up and let me just read something to help this show out. <laughs> add on the spot. We team up with brands that are trying to do something new, unlike the twisted shit we do here. We love innovation and companies that are changing the industries they're in. So when Movement introduced themselves and sent over some watches, we were really impressed. Uh, I'm wearing my watch as usual. Like, let's just, I'm going to pose for the rest of this ad read. Right there. The company started with two broke college kids that wanted to wear stylish watches but couldn't afford them. They did some research and found that the big watch brands were passing huge retail markups to the consumer. Uh, Movement decided that by selling online, they were able to cut out the middleman and provide the best possible price. Uh, Movement watches, they started just $95. Uh, at a department store, you're probably looking for the same quality, like four to $500. Uh, Movement has grown organically, purely by supporters just like you. So join their more than 1 million social media followers and get a Movement watch today. And you can do that by going to mvmtwatches.com slash on the spot and they'll give you 15% off your entire purchase. Uh, again, that's mvmtwatches.com slash on the spot. Go get a watch. Let them know that on the spot sent you. Thank you so much, Movement. I'm so, I used to not be a watch guy, actually. I used, it took me, I just couldn't stand something on my wrist, but I've since, actually literally since getting this watch, I I can't leave the house without a watch Watch on. is a great, great thing to tell time with. Correct. Is that your... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Tyler. Tyler, every time it cuts to our shot, I imagine that they're going to blur our team name and it's just going to be hashtag behind just us. Just a pixelated little blob there. Uh, let's go play some more games. Let's play Impromptu Pitch. Impromptu Pitch is the game where uh, you guys are going to be playing my big uh, screenwriters and I'm the studio exec. And you guys can come up with the next big film idea using prompts that we're gonna give you. We're gonna give you a person, a place, and genre, and we got that from uh, audience and community members. And you guys can use all those prompts to create the best film idea. You can do that one person at a time, back and forth between teammates. I'm gonna ring the bell, and that will signify when you guys switch between teammates. Uh, get interesting, because the best movie idea gets my money slash my points. Um, so I'm excited to see what you guys come up with. We have some fun prompts this week. Uh, pink Slip, let's see what you guys are gonna make a movie out of. Guy Fieri, oh Hell's Kitchen, the show. Uh, and this is a horror from RT user Dr. Harry. Uh, Guy Fieri, greatest uh, you know, possible person for a horror film ever. Uh, and greatest person ever. Best Period. person ever. Yeah. Yeah. He's the mayor of like, of like Austin, right? Or like mm -hmm. governor of Texas, don't, don't something like that? Don't say that shit. Don't say that he shit. He could. No. Do you, if he no. ran for a political office, he could totally get it. God. He could totally get it. If Arnold Schwarzenegger could take over California, Guy Fieri could take over some sort of southern state. Let, let's get to the, the pitch. I, want, I have some things Spoken to say Spoken truly like someone <laughs> from California. One of them Jesus. southern states. Who yeah. Fine. Well, Californians are stupid. We, we, you know, got the governor, the governator. Um, six seconds o'clock, starting off with Meg. Meg, start off this little story for us. Yes. Ready, set, go. All right, we open on Hell's Kitchen, but instead of the TV show, they've actually been transported to another dimension where all they can do is cook and be judged by Gordon Ramsay. And that does happen, but Guy Fieri, while eating, chokes because he's a fat piece of shit and he goes to hell. <laughs> and it's in a kitchen. It's hell's kitchen. Right. In hell. Right. Which is the alternate dimension that you were working against me on while we were doing the pitch <laughs> together. Uh, yeah, so he's in hell's kitchen, and the devil is Gordon Ramsay himself. So he... And, it's, and he's like, you know, Guy, you're going to come up with a new show. Uh... Uh, demons, devils, and Diablo cocks. And what you're gonna do <laughs> yes. is you're gonna take those frosted tips you got and you're gonna start cooking food for all the people in hell. Right, and so actually the frosted tips become his weapon that he uses against the other demons to try and fight his way out of hell. So it'll pull them out of his weird crusty head and then he throws them at demons. But it's really hot in hell so it can't be frosty because that's the thing that's cold. So he has <laughs> nothing and he just cooks for eternity. The end. <laughs> I like that frosted been frozen yes. somehow. Yes. Well, you can't, I mean, the frosted. That's Tyler, has, died, a, died. Tyler has a very literal mind. Yes. It's what the word says is what the word means. That's right. It's hot in hell. What was, <laughs> what was the show you came up with? Dick's Movies and Devils? No, something He's got that, Devils. that show, Diners, Drive-Ins, Drive and, and Dives. Uh, Diablo, Diablo Cox. Cox. Yeah. Diablo Cox, yeah. Just put him on a spigot. That should have been our team name was Diablo Cox. Yeah, Diablo Cox. That guy will never be governor of Texas. <laughs> <laughs> I really you set you off with up. that. I did. Not fair. I, 
Okay. Sorry, Fucking I apologize. Do guy. we get to name our movie? Yeah. We're calling it Fury. Oh. Come on. Oh, boy. Come on. <laughs> Meryl's in the audience, and she couldn't even support you on that Fury. one. Fury. Flavor Town USA. Yeah. Nailed it. Flavor Town USA. Flavor Town USA. Nailed it. Uh, Population obesity. <laughs> what? Points. Yeah, to uh, Lindsay. What's points, us? Points to yeah, Lindsay for that. One. Five <laughs> points to Lindsay. Because Tyler said so. I was good. I got it. Hey, game Thank respect you. game. Hey, can we match up for the yeah. writing? Yeah. yeah. I'll take part of that credit. It's cool. Uh, okay, so that's our first movie. Let's see what the one that's going against going against it will be. Uh, what's their prompts? Vin Diesel. In Great Britain after the Brexit vote. <laughs> Political thriller from RT user Laser Bacon. Uh, Great Britain's going through some fun party times right now. <sighs> Let's see if Vin Diesel can help. Because he helps everything. Six seconds of the clock, starting off with Matt. Ready, set, go. Okay, when The Rock is murdered, everyone <laughs> naturally assumes Vin Diesel did it because he's like the less talented version of The Rock. Yeah, and obviously he's kind of taken on some of the spotlight. He's like, yo, Rock, it's me. I'm not smelling what you're cooking anymore, bitch. It's my okay. turn. So he calls up Great Britain. He's like, yo, you guys just left the EU. Let's... He's like, I gotta get fast and furiously over to Great Britain. Once he gets there, he discovers a post-apocalyptic wasteland. Mm -hmm. And so there's actually, the new movie is planned to merge Fast and the Furious with the Mad Max franchise, where they'll blend together. Uh, and then he gets an Iron Giant suit, and he's like, this is going to be my greatest comeback of all time, but a uh, horrible, like, Boris Johnson monster comes out and is like, you can't enter our country, immigrant. Mm -hmm. And then this little boy comes out in front of Vin Diesel, and he's like, you are not a gun. And he goes, no, what have I become? <laughs> <laughs> There's like two tactics people take yeah. to this game. One is they make something new, yeah. and the other is they just take the movie that the actors in and just mash them all together. Just put them into one film, and that's how a movie's born. Yeah. What the fuck is this called? That was a good line, though, about the Fast and the Furious. Yes. I like that it didn't end. It was just. <laughs> Gotta get to Great Britain fast and furiously. Uh, what's, what called? Is this, what's this called, Lindsay? I feel like it should be called But Not Today. From what? what? <laughs> Watch Fast and Furious, and you'll know. Right. Forget Same. about it, cut. No thanks. <laughs> you guys I, I thought you were gonna call it something like ground and pound, like mm. like to play off the British Ooh. pound a little bit. Mm. That's points. okay. I came up with fury, so I can't really yeah. judge you. Each team comes up with the better team name. Yeah. For the better, <laughs> this movie. Uh, I've watched Fast and Furious one, two, and what's the last one? Seven. Seven. One, two, and seven. Yeah. That's so the no. that's the wow, way I went. Stopped right before one of yeah. the last ones. I wouldn't. Well, Meg, we'll talk after yeah. this. Yeah. <laughs> Let's fucking go, girl. You want a Tokyo Drift? I will take you down right now. You want, <laughs> you want to get the Jones family riled up. You, you are going to get Fast over to my house and, you start and talking watch about Tokyo Drift with me. Yeah. Maybe our movie should be called We'll Be Back. I feel, I like you know, it. Yeah. Why? But Arnold Schwarzenegger wasn't talking. in that. No, it's it's close just, enough. Yeah, yeah same. Arnold Schwarzenegger, The Rock, Vin Diesel, yeah. all the same person. Mm -hmm. <sighs> he came back in Fast and the Furious. God damn it. Dude, come on. Guy Fieri goes he to leaves, hell. Then he comes back. Like, right. come on, man. Demons. Diablo Cox. Devil Yeah, dicks. but I liked, I really did like the Mad Max Fast and Furious mashup. How is that to a be honest. Thriller? How is that Because it happened. It's a they went and he, he said it's Boris funny. Johnson, so he knew that was. I'm going to give points to Matt and Lindsay. Ah, ah, hey. Yeah. Boris Johnson. Hey. What a yes. crock of shit. Yeah. I liked Matt's celebration. Hey. 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 Oh, he's so white. Can you Carlton um, next time we win points? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what we'll put our points at if I give them for that game? Ooh, so wait, I gave them five for that that, that, that makes sense team to me. name. So let's make you. sure that next that, time we do points up, we reflect that properly. That makes Thank it sixteen. You. Good job, Tyler. Five more points, yeah. to Tyler, Matt. for knowing that man. Thank you. I don't know what that would be, but we'll. <laughs> we'll you don't we'll know the alphabet, but damn it, you can count. Yeah, okay. Before <laughs> yeah. there we go. Wow, they're quick. Before we get to. Uh, Redemption Challenge, I got another little something to say. Uh, summer is here, and new clothes are in order. Uh, but there's a problem. Shopping takes forever, and it's not always what you're looking for. Uh, make it easy to look your best in clothes that fit you 
perfectly handpicked by your own personal styles. Who, have, who didn't ever want their own styles to pick out the clothes? Go to trunkclub.com slash on the spot. You type in your measurements. You share your likes and dislikes. You get your very own personal stylist. And then they'll pick out clothes from over 80 top brands and they'll ship them right to your door. You get to keep what you like. You send back what you don't. And then Trunk Club is not just another way to shop online. Your stylist takes time to understand your unique look. And if you live in Dallas, New York, Los Angeles, Chicago, or DC now, you can actually stop by one of their Trunk Club clubhouses to work with your stylist in person for free. So if you want to get a little bit more of personal experience and you're in those cities, show up. Uh, Trunk Club is not a subscription service either. You get your own personal stylist. Shipping is always free and you have 10 days to try on the clothes risk-free. Um, so you get to just do it as you go. Make a statement the next big event on your calendar with a look that's handpicked just for you and your style. Get started at Trunk Club uh, today. Premium clothes, expert advice, zero work on your part. Uh, thanks to your very own personal stylist at Trunk Club. You can get started today at trunkclub.com slash on the spot. That's trunkclub.com slash on the spot. Please use that link to let them know that you heard them from, about them from here. Um, thank you, Trunk Club. Appreciate it. Redemption. Damn. Done. Redemption. So you guys are losing. Yeah. yeah. Um, Go that. figure. <laughs> we got a little game for you guys that we found that people were doing on the internet and we love to just copy whatever else is doing on the internet. Why not? Um, we got some Cheerios. Oh, sweet. Mm -hmm. There's a Cheerio challenge that's challenging people to put as many Cheerios as they can hey, on their partner. We wanted to mix it up a little bit more and make it harder. Meg, I hear you're really good at chopsticks. I'm okay. Hi, Meg, I hear you're really good at chopsticks. Well, thanks for hearing things about, about me. Um, we're going to put, how much time? 60 seconds? 30, 30 seconds. That's oh, much God. better. 30 seconds on the clock. Tyler, you're her, yeah. you're her bowl. Okay. Your face is her bowl. Oh, I like There's that. There's been so much more. <laughs> Tyler, your face is her bowl. Hi-oh. Um, 30 seconds o'clock. Meg, what am I you? doing? Just yeah, what, what are we doing? doing? <laughs> I'm, I'm like her. Is she sitting on I my face or something? I don't know what I'm doing with the bowl. <laughs> Not a toilet bowl, Tyler. Is she putting the Not Cheerios and then bowl. smashing her butt on my face? I don't know what to do. <laughs> like, what are we doing? We got a fucking bowl of cereal and chopsticks. Bowl Most, is bad. However many chi God. <laughs> That's actually impressive. How many can we throw, John? Yeah. How many I think however good. many uh, chairs you can get on Tyler's face in 30 seconds, I'll give you points. What, do this. I throw them? Or am I placing them? Just throw place them. them. Just, place just them. spit on my face All you and then do just <laughs> throw the cereal. All you gotta do is get them to stay on Tyler's face so Tyler can lay back or something like that and make it easier. Yeah. Um, stack them. Oh, you Ready? To, yeah, hold on, she's stack gonna. Em. You can stack them. Stack them on my face? Stack them. You can stack them. It's incredible. She's assuming the position, too. Set. Go. Yes. Stack those on my fucking face. Okay, Please don't say creepy face. things like that. It was while like we do waterboard this. torture. Five more Cheerios and Tyler's gonna They're tell us his secrets. Like be in a tower. There's no way. I you can stack that. them in any way you want. As long eyes. as they pile up on his face. Tyler. Yes. How you feeling? It's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> can she go in? You the seem nose? to be knocking off every cherry that you get on there. Shut Ooh, up, John. No one cares about you. And you're down to one. You got this. Do it. You got this. You got yes. more. Boys. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently that's a really hard challenge. It is hard. You got how many on there? You four? do it. Three or four? Four. That was great. I'll give you 10 points each. Thank you very much. That's 40 points. That'll bring you guys Damn. up to close to even. Thank you. I like everything about this show. Anytime our team does something, people are like, can, can, we, cl can we clap? Is it okay? Is the joke okay? Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. That just describes the audience from the spot. Are we you allowed to clap? Do I put cheerios on Matt's face? It? Possible lawsuit. Yeah. <laughs> did we do, do it like they did on the internet with Maybe that? it would have been I easier. I wonder that. if like your beard would have been easier spot. Like the Velcro would have grabbed it. Oh, here. Maybe just mm -hmm. like another idea entirely. Yeah, maybe that. <laughs> you should have buttered your forehead. Take your head back. Yeah. <laughs> beard will stay. Well, you have to like okay. be flat. I don't okay. think you understand like, physics. Oh my God, look, it sits on my face. Is this the funny? Is it funny yet? Yes. Are y'all laughing? No. Do it more. Do it no. more. Nobody laughs at this. Nobody show. laughs on the spot. <laughs> this is an introspective, just thought-provoking show. Um, let's go to our final I know, game. Like let's do that. What's our final game? Yeah, I don't know. Can I eat these? Nerds? It is right. quick thinking. I know my show. Shut up. Uh, quick thinking is the game where each team will be given a category. No, both teams will be given a category, and they're going to come up with ideas and answers for that category, starting with the letter that we're going to give out. The letter will change throughout the round, so keep an eye on that. Points are given to <laughs> Lindsay really, really yeah, wants some Cheerios. We had a redemption challenge and also, like, just snack time. <laughs> Jeez, that's a lot of Cheerios. Um, points are given to the answers I like. <laughs> Lindsay is now sharing her Cheerios with Matt. Of course. And now I've turn. given them projectiles to throw at me. Can um, you get it in his hair? Points are for ones I like. No points for ones I don't like. See how fast you can get through answers. What's our first category? I might be sticking your hair. 
worst name for a new sex position from mm. RT user Linear Cat. Uh, Linear Cat sounds like a bad sex <laughs> position. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, where's names for sex It's all about positions. the curvy cat. That's where you really get that penetration. I didn't hear the beginning of that sentence. All I heard was that's where you really get that penetration. That's not the last part of a sentence you ever want to hear. What's our starting letter? M. Tyler, my little cherub, let's start off with you. You good with that? Yeah, sure. <laughs> 66 on the clock. Sex positions, they're bad. Go. The Mussy Masher. Mm. That sounds horrible. Points. Uh, Lindsay. The Maleficent. No. Meg. Meg <laughs> Yes. Matt. Uh, the, oh, it's an S. S. Uh, the Soggy Sack Lunch. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Tyler. Um, uh, scary Grandpa. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Lindsay. The Sidewinder. Yes, oh. Meg. The Silverfish. Ooh. No. What? They're gross. Uh, It'll kill Matt you if you try and P. hit it. Uh, Perry the platypus Nice. <laughs> that was good. Yes. Uh, Tyler. Uh, perineum. What the fuck it's is that? It's the anatomical area between a vagina and an asshole. No. I, I didn't even know that. Lynn's, a Lindsay. A periodontal disease. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> Meg. The period party. Hey. Yeah. D. Yeah. Matt. Uh, Dingleberry Delight. <laughs> <laughs> Love that alliteration. Yes, Tyler. Uh, docking. That's a, oh, you're that's no, that's a real no. thing. Fun. No. Oh, wow. The buzzer. What if I had said space docking? Mm. Then oh, you would have been the wrong letter. Yeah. That's innovative. So, no. That one's grosser. <laughs> <laughs> you know that's happened, right? Space they got a docking. lot of time up there. They got to get bored up there and do something, yeah, right? Yeah, absolutely. I don't think anyone's been bored enough. Well, you know what? Never mind. Mm. You want to talk so to Gavin? Someone... You think my dick could fit inside <laughs> your dick? Because I bet it could. Well, they do all kinds of weird, like, zero-gravity, like, experiments. Well, that's like the Apollo 13 where you, like, you retract and then, like, the guys... Do you think one... Wait, yeah. do you think they've ever done the thing where, like, one of them is spinning and trying to dock at the same time? Yes. yes. Rotation? Yes. yes. And the music builds. You're trying, trying, yeah, trying yeah, to yeah, line yeah. it up. <laughs> yes. Thank Anybody you. masturbate in space at this point? No, well, absolutely. I guarantee it. Absolutely. That's the um, first thing I would do <laughs> if I went to space. Like, as soon as they say, and you've left the Earth's atmosphere, Tyler's just like, what do you think John God. Glenn was doing in orbit? I mean, he's got nothing to do. He's got like one fucking window just jerking it. <laughs> the moon. Oh, the sun. <laughs> I know. So hot. The what does the window? Beautiful. He's Venus got a tiny window. What another Earth rising? What does the window? He <laughs> doesn't have a lot of shit to look at. <laughs> so he's masturbating to the planet Earth. Yeah. Yeah. No, he's in his head making, you think nobody's he's making jerked porn it to movies Earth in his before? head. Yeah. I bet somebody's jerked it to Earth. I bet somebody's jerked it to Earth. Earth. Yeah, Welcome with the show Earth. Yeah, with like 2001 Space Odyssey soundtrack just going. Yeah. Like right when it hit the ball. Howl's pretty attractive. Not gonna lie. <laughs> the disembodied voice. voice. <laughs> mm, love that. Let's find out what our final category is. Text you don't want to get from your mom. Text you don't uh, want to get from Dance Bunny 17 let me pull out my phone real quick. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just read them back? I, uh, yeah, okay, so text you don't want to hear, get from your mom, starting with what letter? F. Lindsay, why don't you start us off with this round? F. No, no mommy texts. Go. Freaks and Geeks is still canceled. <laughs> you bitch. Sure, points. Uh, Meg. <laughs> Fucked your dad today. <laughs> <laughs> yep, points, Matt. Found out you're not mine. <laughs> oh Jesus! Yes, Tyler. Um, um, fuck the dog today. <laughs> Fine, I'll give you points for that one. Lindsay E. Everything inside me hurts. Oh yes, points, Meg. Everyone in this family hates you. Oh, we're getting real here. Yes, Matt. Excreted something I thought you should know about. <laughs> yes, points, Tyler. Everyone has AIDS. <laughs> Yes, H, Lindsay. <laughs> Help me take this condom off. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is your mom doing? Yes, Meg. Hurry. Ah, fuck. Um, I don't know. Shit. I just move on. <laughs> <laughs> that would be a bad text. Yes. Matt. Uh, hail Hydra. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I nice. will definitely give points to that. Um, <laughs> right, Charlie, you had your freak out before the show started. <laughs> yeah. If my mom texted me, hurry, fuck, shit, pass, I don't know, yeah. I'd be concerned. Thank that you. Would be, yeah. I'd be concerned. That's what I was going for the whole time. It was a performance piece. Yeah. You wouldn't just be like, oh, you're drunk again. <laughs> no, <laughs> mom. You're mom. Stop it. Drunk mom in her texts. <laughs> Classic. Uh, okay, so we'll add up points of all that, and 
I think that's all. That's all the games. So let's find out what final points are. Oh, oh my oh. God! Damn. Close. Yes. Wow. Woo. We did it. Best, for, we did it for Michael. We yeah. did. Yeah. Meg's last chance to win. Yeah. I'll pull Man, a Tyler. Like, ripped that. away from my. Yep. Ripped away from me too yeah. soon. <laughs> <laughs> well, to be fair, we got the Cheerios, so I think I do win a little bit. Yeah, yeah. but Tyler shared. No, I like sharing with Tyler. Yeah. And the other team. <laughs> Gavin That's doesn't like, have to know. I either. thought you meant sharing with Tyler, and then I realized what you meant. Yeah. After that. Oh wait, like. All like of something. Oh, dirty? sharing your butthole? No, I meant the Cheerios. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah. You don't want my butthole. You can share someone's butthole. DP. Oh, someone else's butthole. Yeah, D someone else's DVDA. Butthole. You could share your own butthole as well. But how do you share both your buttholes? What do you, wait, why Who do you have two? two buttholes? Yeah. The astronauts well, two launch two at each buttholes. other in space and they spread their ass cheeks apart. <laughs> and there, then they well, come at each other. Wait, there's this is one Apple movie. Is talking a thing? This is movie sure. with Jennifer Conley and she's like, if you, you know what I'm talking about? If this is docking. What is? They're like wait. ass what to is, ass. What is oh, assholes? No. Bumping donuts? donuts? But docking has such like a one word kind of thing. There's gotta be a one word for this. Donating. Donating. <laughs> thank you, Barbara. Okay, thank you, I'll go with that. Do you have to have Matt's like a prolapsed a anus to do it? Like do you need one that's gonna like suck over the other one? That's the risk you, you take, man. Enough, I think if you, if you pull, right. you can flatten that out enough to get to like, to really present is your like asshole. Is like a vacuum oh. seal sort of there? Not in space. That work? Like no. two plungers. <laughs> is that what it is? It's plunging. 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 Mm -hmm. plunging. Um, Not clunging, different. Right, right. Very. This is totally how we're supposed to end this show. <laughs> Thank uh, you to our sponsors. What belching was. <laughs> Thanks. Movement Watches and Trunk Club for sponsoring this train wreck that God hates and is sending thunder and hurricanes to kill. Tell, tell them what it is, Meg. What? What, tell felch what? what felching is. What's felching? You said it was something with assholes. We'll do it on the post show. No. Okay. Bye! <laughs>